Hello, everyone out there that gives rats a. Got some pictures for you. This was a couple weeks ago. I am sorry it's behind. I didn't feel it was that important, and I don't think it really is. It's just some more, uh, some more information for you, some more proof that, yes, these bastards do land down in here. <clears throat> um, this right here is a cobra. There was two of them. There's a Huey. There was two of them, four in all, once again, like the last uh, pictures that I'd shown and update I'd given. This was at the airport, down at a job site we were working on. I only got work for a couple days, but it was better than nothing. Made a couple hundred bucks, you know, so. And during that time, we get to see choppers, so that was pretty cool, actually. They did not land very far away from us, let me tell you. That was about 300 feet. Two, three hundred feet, and those babies kick off some freaking air. These here are, uh, I would have to think they would be actual live ammunition missiles. Had the big gun up front, the mini gun. Uh, but like I said, they're Cobras, they weren't Apaches or whatever else they have in their yeah, little stuff. Cobra. Uh, Hugh. There. Uh, this thing's hard to operate. Another one about, I believe they're landing right then. It is quite the sight. Let me tell ya. Anyway. They're Marines. And, uh. Yeah. Marines. So. Um, we talked to, they, okay, they were doing logging hours, I guess. We talked to one guy, they all come in and took a dump or whatever, you use our porta potty at the job site, stretched a little bit. <clears throat> talked to one of the guys, he was 22, he'd been in there, you know, however long, three years, I guess. But he'd been to Iraq twice on the plane he took care of, he was a mechanic, uh, and he said that they'd been in Tempe in Phoenix the night before. Uh, Tempe's right in Phoenix. It's like L.A. They're all botched together. Um, and, uh, <coughs> just that they were logging in hours. So, fly time, I guess. But, you know, they're running their path, training all the time, as usual. And, uh... We're doing our job, and he's like, "Man, I'd rather be doing what you guys are doing than what we're and what I do. What I'm doing, I'd way rather be out." He said he's got a year left, and he's done. 22 years old, so I don't know. They're all the same as us. I got buddies that have been in the military. I know people that are in it. Uh, so it's not like, oh, we think, oh, oh, they're gonna come get us. I'm sure some of them are really screwed up, yeah, but. You know, they're average people just like us. They got families. They just want to live like the average Joe, man. Be free. Drink beer every night, whatever they do. Uh, so, I don't know. They don't really tweak on me out or nothing. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, got a cold. A little bit of one. Need eating more jalapenos. And, uh, blah, 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 blah. let me think. I'm trying to think. Ah. My brother, he drives a semi-truck. He owns his own rig and drives for United. He pulls their trailer, moves houses. He pulls a lot of military uh, contracts with them. Housing. Uh, not machinery or anything. And... He's been moving a lot of them down to, like, the New Mexico area. They're all moving around quite a bit, but they're moving all over the place. Um, then he's, he's all, he goes, he's got a continental run. He goes across the country, so he's west coast, east coast, back, back, a lot. And he's seen quite a bit of equipment and different things on flatbed, truck trailers. Uh, the usual, but he said there seemed to be a bit more, and he's seen a lot of those uh, ton and a halfs or whatever they're called, the big infantry 
movers, the six axle, <coughs> hummers, and different little military type vehicles roaming around. So whatever. I don't know. Who knows? We don't know. We get inklings of clues from sources, and we know that these motherfuckers are going to probably, something will be enacted for sure, but I don't know if they'll just come in and do what, I don't think they'll just come in straight up martial law status, start fucking taking people off. Probably going to be for those that raise a, a ruckus, you know. But anyway, uh, what else here? Just the helicopters. I think they've come like once since then in the last two weeks and nothing else. Haven't really seen any planes. No real activity here. Just fucking job loss. More things going down the pooper. That's uh, a guarantee. So, uh, I don't know. <laughs> Who knows what? We're in purgatory. We're waiting for something. It either gotta get better, better, or worse. I'm. I don't want it to go down the shitter necessarily, but it pretty much has to because we're. There's no fixing this, and society as a whole is really shitty. You know. We are. A quite the creature. Destroy, kill, all kinds of interesting things we do. <sighs> For what? For what ends? Nah. Whatever. That's all I can ever say. Whatever. Whatever. It is what it is. Life is what it is. I probably loved this son of a bitch a hundred times before. Feels like it. I can't, I haven't quite gotten it right yet, you know? It's kind of like going to heaven or hell, but yet, you just come back again till you get it right. I'm more of the reincarnation, you know, type. The Bible even speaks of reincarnation as of, like, when, um, yeah, I can't think of them, I don't really care, but Ezekiel or Moses, I have been before, and, uh, you know. It does not speak of there is no reincarnation. If you read that book back to back, front to back, you'll find out a couple of things, and you gotta look at it logically. Anyway, keep the faith in yourself. I'm sorry for you people that love the religion and rely on God or Jesus, but you can't rely on something that ain't there. I'm spiritual. I'm kind of like the I like the natives way of looking at it. Earth, you're happy for what you get given from whatever god it may be that you think is a god. But there ain't no guy up there holding a freaking cane on a pedestal going to be like, "Oh, you are all right. You are all right." Ah, it doesn't make no sense. And I've studied quite a bit. Anyway, if you guys want respond, text you want to have an argument on religion, I'm down. I like that. You got to take, God only helps those that help themselves. That's a big key issue right there. If you are religion, I'm not dissing you, I'm just saying. It's all in you. Don't blame something else. Okay, peace out. <laughs>